Now, honoring the life and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. In just two hours, crowds will gather along the streets of downtown Jacksonville for the MLK Holiday Grand Parade. Things officially kick off at 10. News for Jack's reporter Brianna Andrews is live at Lot J outside the stadium. And there's already a great deal of life out there, Brianna. Yes, Bruce. Oh my goodness. There's so many people here already starting to line up. I want to show you a bit of what we're seeing out here. You can see all of these cars lining up and a bunch of people out here getting ready for the festivities to kick off, which the parade does kick off at 10 this morning. There's a bunch of people out here, a bunch of cars lined up. People are just getting ready to march in just a few hours. Now take a look at this map. It etches out the parade's route. It kicks off from Lot J, goes from Gator Bowl Boulevard to Bay Street, ending at the Prime Osborne Convention Center. The route spans about two miles and in past years has taken about three hours for everyone to make the trip. Now this is video from last year's parade. We expect to see much of the same festivities like local marching bands, dance troops, and decorated vehicles, of course. The only major difference is the parade's new theme, Jacksonville, a city united against hate and gun violence. MLK Day celebrations happened all week long. On Friday, the MLK breakfast kicked off a week of service where people are encouraged to volunteer in their communities to honor King's legacy. United Way and partners are also leading one of the biggest volunteer efforts across all three counties. That's Duval, Nassau, in Clay counties until the 20th. Now I want to give you another live look from La J. You see it is filling up relatively quickly. I want to uh, show Jesse right over here where we see those cheerleaders uh, getting ready, practicing over there, getting ready for the big day. So there's a lot of excitement out here. Now keep in mind, if you do want to volunteer across any of the counties, Duval, Nassau, or Clay, you can visit newsforjacks.com. We have so much information there. Now we also have more events that's happening to celebrate MLK Day on our website as well. But for now, though, I'm reporting live. Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, the local station.